There is a time for everything and a season for every activity under heaven. A time to be born and a time to die. A time to plant and a time to uproot. A time to kill and a time to heal. A time to tear down and a time to build. A time to weep and a time to laugh. A time to mourn and a time to dance. We gather together today to commit Winifred Miller Thompson to her final resting place. We gather to comfort each other in our grief and to honor the life that Winifred led. A life that was full of hope, happiness, laughter and love through good times as well as in bad. This is the way we will always remember Winnie, that she lived her life as an example to each and every person she met, that love is an action, not just a feeling. And the practice of giving of ourselves is the truest way to honor God. Romans 8 records these words of the Apostle Paul. I am convinced that neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor anything else in all creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. As we lay Winnie's body in the grave, let's rejoice that she is experiencing the love of God in Christ Jesus, face to face. For as much as the spirit of this departed loved one has returned to God who gave it, we therefore tenderly commit Winifred's body to the ground, earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. In sure trust and certain hope in the power and love of Christ our Lord, whose divine call they that sleep in him shall one day rise to stand with him, and here with all saints, welcome summons, enter into your master's joy. For his is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the fellowship of the Spirit, be with you all.